Hello, everyone. My name is Akio Kasuga, president of FIB from 2021 to 2022. This is a message for me for a new era of FIB. The year of 2020 finished in chaos, and 2021 started with uncertainty about the future. This is the beginning of a new period which has never seen before. We have been plunged into a virtual world. However, we have discovered that committees and symposium can be made to work online. At the same time, we have been feeling that we missed something and how in-person meetings are essential for our organization. We know that the COVID-19 pandemic has fundamentally changed the world. The World Economic Forum announced the Great Reset as the theme for its annual meeting in January 2021. Also in 2020, both the EU and Japan declared goals of carbon neutrality by 2050. And now there are already 77 countries participating in this movement. Moreover, with the COVID-19 pandemic, calls for global action on climate change are beginning to accelerate with higher level action. I would like to talk about the FIB's Great Reset. Concrete structures are linked to large amount of carbon emission from the manufacture of materials to their construction and operation. For a long time, this was considered unavoidable and concrete seems as an essential material for human prosperity. This situation has now changed. We can no longer do business as usual and cannot continue to use today's materials. Instead, we should contribute our expertise to the effort to achieve the ambitious goal of becoming carbon neutral by 2050. In the future, the world will likely prioritize concrete structures that minimize carbon emission over minimum cost. When that happens, the public may demand figures for the carbon emission of pro project from the owners of concrete structures, as well as from the engineers involved in project design and construction. We have to ask ourselves, what sort of support can FIB give to members when this figure becomes a reality? To address that question, I suggest two key words. The first keyword is sustainability. FIME members are researchers, engineers, and designers, and they are involved in material selection, design, construction, conservation, intervention, demolition, reuse, and recycling. And together, they are involved in all aspects of concrete structure throughout its lifetime. The FIB is an organization that brings together state-of-the-art technologies in these areas. Sustainability was first taken into account in Model Code 2010. It has now become one of the foundation of the Model Code 2020 revision. Publication of our new Model Code is the FIB's most significant mission for this year. The optimum solution for three pillars of sustainability, the social, economic, and environmental pillars leads to a reduction in carbon emissions. Pursuing sustainability through concrete structures in this way, we meet the requirements for the future world trends. To achieve carbon reduction in concrete structure, 
we have to consider the whole process, taking both upstreams and downstream factors into, take, into account. For example, when procuring construction materials, we need to think about the global environment and use local materials as much as possible. The FIB committees need to put their efforts into the integration of low carbon technologies into the process. The second keyword is intergenerational collaboration. In 2050, the key roles in our industry will be played mainly by people who are currently in their 20s or 30s. But what we in the next 10 years will be crucial successfully meeting the 2050 goal of the carbon neutrality. We need to through, truly discuss the issue and decide on the appropriate direction for the FIB, taking into account the expected situation in 30 years. The FIB young member group has an important role to play in this process. I strongly encourage our young members to participate in various FIB activities. I'm convinced that young members' action will help them secure their own future. To adapt to the transformations that our world is undergoing, we must set a new course as soon as possible. We need to share the expertise and wisdom for all 41 national member groups. Through this collaboration, we can make the use of low carbon technologies important factors in adapting to climate change. It has become very evident that natural disasters around the world are being intensified by climate change. Global society faces many issues, but COVID-19 has made action on climate change an even more important priority. There is no longer any doubt. Nobody knows more about concrete than the FIB. By putting our brain together, we can find a solution and continue contributing to the prosperity of humanity. Thank you very much for your attention.